So <coughs> thank you very much indeed. Uh, I really am delighted to be here today as a member of the, the working group that helped bring this uh, ESRC doctoral training centre into being, uh, a group so ably chaired by Professor Gareth Rees, uh, now Director of Wizard. Uh, I'm delighted to be here for its formal launch, uh, and I have to say, in relation to Wizard, that uh, it contributed, of course, not only its present director to the project, but also, in some respects, its model, uh, a model of successful uh, Wales-wide collaboration and a track record of outstanding research, much of it with a, a specific focus on, on Wales. However, I would also like to acknowledge today the contribution of uh, HEFCU uh, and the Welsh Government, uh, whose support for this doctoral training centre has been clear, consistent, uh, from the outset, uh, and whose contribution to the doctoral training centre resources means that the centre has the wherewithal, I think, to, to make a real difference uh, to both the capacity uh, and the connectedness of uh, social science in Wales. The Wales DTC has already been successful in increasing the number of ESRC studentships in Wales to well beyond its allocation. Uh, and this means that this September some 53 studentships get underway with a significant external funding component for these. And I'm particularly pleased that some of the organisations which have provided this funding uh, are represented here today. I think it's also important to note that a significant number of these studentships will be supporting interdisciplinary research uh, and research in what the ESRC has identified as shortage or uh, endangered uh, disciplines. As I hardly need to say uh, to, to this audience, the challenges confronting our society in the early part of the 21st century are truly formidable. Social inequality, pressures on local communities born of turbulent financial circumstances, a demographic in Britain and Wales increasingly skewed to the aged end of the spectrum, the social, economic, cultural challenges of inward migration, the effective and cost-effective delivery of health cons uh, care, citizenship and participation, skills and employability, work and well-being, housing and homelessness, these are just some, some of the contemporary and intensifying challenges which Wales faces as a nation. Uh, they are issues which impact, I think, on, on every aspect of our lives and on the possibility of a full uh, and a civilised existence for our people and our communities. And the effectiveness with which we address them will have a fundamental bearing on the quality of life uh, of uh, uh, of, of future generations. They are critical areas uh, of policy making in Wales and if such policy making is to be well informed and evidence based then it must be underpinned by robust social science research. Robust for social science is there to challenge not just to support and if it doesn't speak truth to power then I believe it will have reneged on its best traditions as a discipline. This Wheels DTC is about training and inspiring the next generation of social scientists in Wales. It's about equipping them with the skills necessary to tackle the challenges to which I've just alluded. It's about producing social science researchers, the quality of whose research will register nationally and internationally and it is about promoting their engagement with the private, the public, and the third sectors, because social science, good social science, should be about making a difference, as Marx put it uh, in his thesis on the German philosopher Ludwig Farbach. Uh, philosophers, and for, for philosophers we can read social scientists. Philosophers have hitherto interpreted the world. The point is to change it. And I look forward over the years ahead to the Wales DTC producing cohorts of young social science researchers who will do, who will do just that. Thank you very much.
gives me great pleasure now to introduce uh, Dr. David Grant, uh, the Vice-Chancellor of Cardiff University, uh, to address the audience. Thank you.